So first, congratulations, Ricky Carmichael, on the championship. Thanks. It's uh, it, it's it's a great feeling, you know. It's uh, it was a long 20 laps out there tonight, and a uh, long week for me, and uh, you know, it was uh, I I thought I had second place secured the last five laps. Uh, I was pulling away a little bit, and. Uh, Got caught up and, and Kevin got by me. He was uh, he he was riding aggressive there. He was running good. He uh, when he when he passed me, he was charging really hard and uh, on the obstacles and stuff. And uh, I owe it to the guy. He uh, he beat me. And uh, you know I'm I'm pumped for the the title. It was a uh, you know it was a commitment in, in December for me, and uh, I needed to do it. And uh, uh, I'm just happy to be up here. You know, I don't know what the problem is. I don't know if it you know it's me or something with uh, that's inside of me that uh, goes goes into a little more conservative mode, but uh, you know it's a uh, pretty tough pill to swallow. That was a uh, pretty poor performance on, on my behalf. You know, uh, uh, I feel like I'm charging, but uh, evidently I'm not. I'm not, and uh, you know it's a little disappointing in, in the ride. But it, you know it's a, it's a bittersweet day for me. It was chaos for sure, and I I seen Chad catching catching us the uh, the whole time. Actually, you know, after the first five laps, he, he seemed like he started catching, and uh, uh, you know, he was he was definitely a, a man possessed. And uh, but we did what we had to do, or or I did, and uh, you know, it's not the way that I want to do it, but uh, hey, that, that's that's the way it goes. And uh, just want to congratulate Kevin and, and Bubba on on great rides and. Uh, Looking forward to uh, to racing them in a couple of weeks. It's frustrating, you know. I'm uh, I'm sick at myself, and you know I don't know what the problem is. I, had, you know, I I dominated at St. Louis. That was a great race for me. And uh, the next weekend, you know, I was second slower a lap, and you don't get that much slower in, in one week. I don't I don't care who you are or what you are. When the season started, I said if I'm in a position to win, I ain't gonna let that happen again this year. And, doing exactly what I didn't want to do, so uh, you know, I don't know what the problem is, but uh, i gotta, I got to work it out for sure. You know, even going back to the first part of the season, you hear Ricky talk about, you know, confidence and whoops, and, you know, it's just this whole game is about that. You know, we, we ride day in and day out. You know, most of us do, you know, four to five days a week, which so only leaves the days traveling off, and, and uh, you know, you just have those two or three bad rides, and it, it just really works on you, and, and uh, finally I'm over that. Uh, feel great. It's a good time for it because you know I want to finish the season out strong and, and uh, put myself in a good position for for outdoors. I saw him kind of get slingshot off the track, and you know I felt like I had the position, you know, especially being on the inside, and, and then James uh, kind of come around the outside, and all of a sudden Chad came around the outside as well. So um, you know there just definitely wasn't enough room in that turn for three of us, and uh, you know luckily I was on the inside and. Uh, it worked out for me all, all right, you know, it's particularly got with, with James from, from the beginning. He broke away pretty quick. You know, I just was doing my thing, and, and I, I don't really know what, what happened for me to close the gap, but uh, I did. I felt like I was doing the same thing that, that I'd always been doing, so I wasn't really paying much attention to Ricky at that point. I was just kind of riding on the race, and all of a sudden, he's he kind of in the same corner as me. I was like, wow, I got, sh I got a shot at this. So, uh, you know, that's what happened to me, but as far as him, I, I would imagine probably the same thing. My average were pretty tough out there. I learned a lot these last, you know, three races since I've been back. You know, I, I feel like every week I'm getting stronger, and, and you know, I, I like racing with these guys. So, um, you know, I definitely did slow down. You know, the track was, was getting worse and worse, and, um, you know, it was, um, I was catching a lot of the slappers, and they were still up and battling because, you know, we got in the top ten, and, uh, you know, they wanted to continue racing, and, and I was trying to move through. So, you know, it was it was good. You know, it was a good night. I, I felt strong the whole race, and, uh, you know, it got me a good, good win. Like Kevin said, you know, it was, um, you know, that first corner I couldn't fit three of us in there, and, uh, you know, I was in the middle, and, you know, I kind of stood on the outside, but, you know, I think what Chad did tonight is something I was supposed to do, you know, that just go wide open and, and wish for the best, and uh, <laughs> it didn't work out. I, um, you know, I, I want to apologize to him right now, you know, I know these guys are racing for a championship, but I'm also trying to win races, and you know, I can definitely tell you I didn't mean to hit them, I, I kind of, Realized when I was hitting the triple and he was getting back on the track that he actually went down, but um, it, was, it was nothing to it. I just think we all came together and uh, you know, he got the, the bad end of the stick.